In the midst of the Great War, a young man named William Terry Badham embarked on a journey in his Battle of Megiddo in 1918 that would change his life in the course of history. How did these daring pilots of World War I take to the skies and turn the tide of battle? And how were these planes a turning point in history? With advances in engine design and aerodynamics, these early planes were fragile, yet formidable. Their capabilities were expanding at an unprecedented pace, and with them, the fate of nations hung in the balance. I'm being drafted. Oh, William, promise me you come back to safety. I promise I'll do my best. All right, recruits. Today, you will be learning how to become fighter pilots. You will be flying a Samsung 2A2 into the hearts of our enemies. Sir, yes, sir. I'll do my best, sir. I hear it's tough, but we make it good. I hope so. I hope so. In the heart of battle, William and his comrades face their greatest test. Every plane team coming, get ready. This is it, lads. Stay focused, lads. We can do this. William and his comrades hurry to their planes. Stay focused, everyone. We can do this. How you escape? Evasive maneuvers! Oh, not this time. Remember, William, it's not just about landing a bullseye in a plane. It's about the endurance. It's about agility. Right now, you're going to meet the greatest enemy, the greatest enemy Germans you've ever seen. They've invented a new plane efficient enough to turn an amateur German into a professional Red Baron. I keep that in mind, sir. Very well, William. Okay. Do your best. You're doing exceptionally well. Don't die. Thanks. As William's duel in the skies unfolded, the battlefield below was a scene of chaos. The swift arrival of advanced aircraft like the Fokker D-7 marked a turning point. This machine, with its advanced mechanics and revolutionized reconnaissance, gave the central powers the upper hand in the skies. However, with resolute determination, William and his comrades demonstrated the prowess of these fighter crafts, effectively securing a crucial advantage in the Battle of Megiddo. With unwavering courage, William achieved victory in the skies. Let's remember those that sacrificed so much as women. We remember the brave souls who gave their all for a better world. May your brave souls never be forgotten. For your exceptional bravery and valor, we honor you with the Distinguished Service Cross. I honor this medal on behalf of my comrades. Well done, William. As the war drew to a close, the impact of the advancements in aviation technology reverberated through the years. The once tumultuous skies, marred by the thundering engines of warplanes, transformed into a frontier of progress. The Samson 2A2 and Fokker Eindecker, marvels of engineering, stood as testament to human ingenuity. They were equipped with synchronized machine guns, a revolutionary development that allowed pilots to fire through their propellers without endangering themselves, a feat that drastically enhanced air combat capabilities. With the armistice, the cessation of hostilities brought both relief and reflection. The world emerged from the dark clouds of war, and the lessons learned in the crucible of battle echoed far beyond the fields of conflict. Aviation, once an experimental endeavor, now became a corner store of progress. The demand for faster, more reliable aircraft soared, and war had spurred innovation in aerodynamics. Engines and materials, leading to a new generation of planes capable of greater speeds and altitudes, Pioneering aviators and aircraft manufacturers seized this opportunity. The post-war era saw a surge in civil aviation. Planes that had once been instruments of destruction now became vessels of peace, connecting cities, nations, and continents. The soldiers in this war, but more specifically the pilots, fought not only for victory, but for a better future. In the end, William was finally able to return home to his friends and family. Welcome home. Welcome home. The emergence of airplanes during World War I marked a pivotal moment in the archives of military history. These early aircraft, though humble by today's standards, represented a groundbreaking technological leap. 
With innovations in engine design, aerodynamics, and materials, planes became more reliable and versatile. Their introduction fundamentally altered the nature of warfare, introducing a third dimension to the battlefield. Armed with machine guns, planes could engage in deadly dogfights, reshaping strategies and tactics. Moreover, they brought about a revolution in reconnaissance and intelligence gathering. Suddenly, commanders had the ability to survey enemy positions, troop movements, and supply lines from the air, providing invaluable information for strategic decision-making. The skies, once the domain of birds, now became a dynamic theater of combat, and this transformation marked the turning point in history, heralding the future of aerial warfare and forever altering the face of modern conflict.